The NFL Combine is a yearly experience where the top college athletes looking for a shot to play professionally showcase their skills to a crowd of scouts. It's an incredible opportunity. But one of the NFL's higher-ups thinks the Combine has racism as a top pick. For MRC TV, I'm John Simmons and welcome to the Woke World of Sports. At a recent league meeting, NFL owners were suggesting ways to improve the combine experience for prospects when executive vice president of football operations Troy Vincent made a ridiculous statement. Vincent said that the combine isn't just in need of improvement, he thinks it's so bad that he compared it to a slave auction. Several owners were rightfully upset with Vincent's notion and immediately pushed back against his statement, including Arthur Blank, Jerry Jones, and Art Rooney II. What further makes this ridiculous is that Vincent has been in some type of leadership position for the NFL's operations since 2014, yet only now does he think there's something wrong with the Combine. Maybe he was persuaded by everyone's favorite race baiter, Colin Kaepernick, who released a documentary last year on Netflix that suggested the same thing. But no matter who's suggesting the idea, it's absolutely absurd. Slaves didn't endure auctions for the chance to play a game for millions of dollars and receive the adulation of fans. Plus, eligible players have the choice to come to the NFL Combine. Nothing about the Combine remotely suggests racism. If a franchise wants to fork over millions a year to have someone play football for them, it makes sense the vetting process would be extensive. Not only is it foolish for Vincent and Kaepernick to suggest something like this, in doing so, they cheapen the meaning of the words racism and slavery. Both of those words refer to the process of owning or looking down upon someone based on their skin color. Not a once a year event where hundreds of college kids are given an opportunity to show their talent so they can earn millions. It's despicable to think, and especially say, anything different. 